A clue. You see a clue? Where? Oh, there is a clue on that newspaper. A newspaper? What does a newspaper have to do with hats? I'm not sure, Elmo. But we still need to write the clue. Who's gonna draw it? Me. I'll draw the clue. Okay. A newspaper. Let's draw a square for the paper. A couple of lines on the inside. A little square right here, and we'll write down the word news on top. There, a newspaper. Alright. Our first clue, is a newspaper. I wonder what Spock could like about hats, with a newspaper. Yeah, that could be it. But I think we should look for two more clues. Just to be sure, well, in the meantime, Elmo has a question, for you. Oh really? What's today's question Elmo? Elmo wants to know, how many hats, will drop on her heads? Ooh. Good question Elmo. How many hats do you think will drop on our heads? Maybe. Let's find out. One hat. Two hats. Three hats. Four hats. Bark bark. So how many hats dropped on our heads? Five hats. Five hats. Right. That's how many heads fell on our heads. Great counting. Bark bark bark. Yeah. That was great. And now... You've got mail! You've got mail! Oh look. We just got an email. 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 We wonder who it's from. Hey, it's an email from Juliet. Hi guys. I sent this email to you to show you a magic trick with my hat. Here it goes. Whoa. I did it. I made Dipsy appear from my hat. How cool is that? Bye guys. Bye Juliet. Great trick, and I'll see you at home. Thanks computer.